So today we're removing the entire rear hubs with the uh, axles as well and we're doing this to uh, change the axles from automatic to manual or if you want to just remove this to uh, you know refurbish the rear hub or do your wheel bearings or whatever you can see here it's fairly dirty rusty could use with them some love this is the driver side I've already done and we're doing the uh, passenger side I'll show you that right now so let's take a look here so as you can see we've already removed the strut with the shock um, did that in a separate blurb and so that's already been removed and now the next steps here also the caliper has been removed for redoing the brakes you can see the emergency brake line is here so look at my other videos for those steps but uh, the first thing we have to do and do this the exact same procedure on the passenger side is uh, pull out the axle so on the automatics here you can actually just pull the rubber boot you just pull it towards you this way I used a you know a large uh, wrench here and just grab it and pull and it'll pop off and then the axle actually just comes out and there's a bunch of grease in there so be careful it doesn't drip Um, so this this side is the passenger side. You can see the axle is much longer than the other side. But again, they both just pop out. And then once we've done that, we can remove the uh, rear joint here. The re or sorry, the rear tie rod. So just take out the pin, uh, take out the nut here, and then you're going to have to use a uh, two or three jaw puller to pop this thing out. And be careful; it's fairly loud. And then the last thing here is to take out the two bolts that hold the ball joint and then once those are all out this thing will just fall off and we can get to cleaning it and removing this uh, this axle now I've been told or I've read somewhere that you don't want to spin the bearings in the rear here without the axles in or else it will ruin them so make sure that you don't do that after you if you're going to remove these axles but uh, for now we're just going to leave them in so it'll be okay and those are the steps